connection through mindfulness is an absolute must. But the other part of this too is not just communication with others, but it's also understanding the messages, the communication I have internally with myself, which ultimately takes us into that realm of emotional maturity. Okay, so that was 2021. So what am I thinking about for 2022? Well, I'm actually thinking about taking this whole issue about individualism to task. The problem that we have currently is that um, we're so focused on our individual rights that we're losing a sense of responsibility for others. We need to really take a good, hard look at that. And the way that I want to do that is to link personal growth to the growth of relationships and to then take that into the more into the outer world you know your professional growth uh, and your social development your your growth as a member of a community we know that one of the problems with men's mental health is isolation and alienation we want to really get stuck into that roadblock. Because what we need right now in this time and age is not just emotional intelligence, but social intelligence. So my challenge to you in the new year is to think about The difference you can make, not just to yourself, but prioritise the difference that you can make in your community. And that starts off with your intimate relationship. It starts off as you as a parent, and it starts off as you in your broader community. Have you said hello to your neighbour? Do you know who your neighbour is? Is there some conflict there? What's that conflict really about? Some of those things you may have absolutely no influence over but it's well worth thinking about and reflecting on, all right? So this is where I want to set the agenda for the coming year. Now, to wind this up, and I wish you all the very best for 2022, is first thing, don't get tempted to make New Year's resolutions. They create as much as happiness, unhappiness. Most of us never follow through, never finish up with what we set out to do on that New Year's resolution. And for a lot of people, they make them when they're drunk or out of it, and that's not good either. Be sober, be emotionally sober. Right? That will create a much better platform to start the new year off. So the other thing that I want to encourage you on is that in the new year, I'm going to be uh, launching a new website. Um, Details will follow. But for the time being, please go to www.goodmengreat.com. Have a look at that. I have another webpage, www.guntaswoboda.com. Uh, that has a lot more information about some of the more public things that I'm doing. But please, look after yourself. And I'm so looking forward to you guys joining me in the new year for something exciting. We're going to make this an exciting year. It doesn't necessarily need to be materially successful, but as long as you're leveraging your capacity to thrive, we're going to have a fantastic time. Until 2022, this is me signing off for the last time in 2021. Until next year. Well, that's a wrap, folks. Miranda Spigner sapone here. I am the executive producer of Inspire Change. And we want to thank everybody out there for taking the time to help make Inspire Change and Gunter's good, Making Good Men Great program um, and movement for what it is 
Um, this has been, you know, an interesting year coming off of a, out of a pandemic, which is still among us um, as we got other variants about. But, you know, we make the best of things. You know, we be we we got to keep being resilient and and working with moderation and and inspiring others and inspiring our fellow humanity and and not falling victim to conspiracy theories and taking some things with a grain of salt and others with full force and full heart um out there everybody we hope you had a great holiday and you're gonna have a great new year we're not gonna be about resolutions it's about just get out there and make it happen Whatever your dream is, whatever your goal is, don't let things stop you. Don't let things get in your way. Um, and after that, I will let the rest of my pre-recorded outro continue. If you want to know more about, you know, coaching from Gunter, um, coming up in our future season four, which will kick off around the, usually the second week of January, we'll start season four with our new sponsors and new everything, uh, new design posters. Uh, we're going to have a lot more going on with Patreon. Um, so much more is coming about and we can't wait to have you on board. We've got some amazing people that are going to be joining as guests um, in our season four. And uh, we're, we're glad to have you. And thank you so much for being part of Inspire Change with Gunter. Um, we, we look forward to it. And everybody have a safe, happy, healthy new year. And uh, be resilient. Be mindful. Be kind and have gratitude. Thank you. Gunter Solvoda does individual and group coaching for men looking to grow. For more information on this and the Global Making Good Men Great movement, check out goodmengreat.com to get into contact. If you have a topic for the show or would like to be a guest on the air, please email producers at Miranda at Nortainment.com. That's Miranda, M-I-R-A-N-D-A, at Noirtainment, N-O-I-R-T-A-I-N-M-E-N-T.com. Thank you, and always keep inspiring change.